father's name has been the butt of jokes nationwide this week. Today, the son of Fort Wayne's former mayor, Harry Balls, is weighing in on the idea behind the laughter, naming the new government center for his dad. News Channel 15's Adam Widener joins us live from Studio 15 tonight. So, Adam, you talked to the former mayor's son today. Yeah, Mark, his name is Donald Bales. He's 94 years old and lives in Virginia. When I asked him what he would think about our new government building being named the Harry Ball Center, he laughed and said that's why he changed the pronunciation to Bales. The recent attention all started with this little website, Feedback Fort Wayne. A naming contest for the new city county government building went viral. More than 20,000 votes have been cast for longtime mayor Harry Balls. Originally, city officials said they didn't want to be the butt of late-night TV jokes, but now that the national spotlight is on Fort Wayne, they've had a change of heart, saying they couldn't be happier. The former mayor's son laughed about the matter, saying today, Harry Balls really isn't a good name for anything. Eighty years ago, it really wasn't an issue. Not really. I mean, I hadn't run into anything one way or the other on that, but uh, it didn't seem to bother anybody. He was a very down-to-earth, straightforward, talkative guy. And you could walk down the street with him and about every other person he'd speak to by name. Now, the mayor should choose a name for the building by the end of the month. Regardless, city officials want to do something for Mayor Balls after all this attention. We're live in Studio 15 tonight. Adam Widener, News Channel 15.